we have an epidemic going on in our society that I don't see getting healed and fixed, getting eradicated anytime soon. What is the disease that I'm talking about? The disease that I'm talking about is simping. Simping has gotten way out of control. We're to the point now where the television shows, the music, everything trains men to be simps. So it's almost inevitable right now because society churns out, the machine churns out simps automatically. And if you don't have this information, you're gonna fall victim to it. So before we get too far into this video and I break down what I'm talking about today, uh, you guys, I know you've seen this, the thumbnail. I need you guys to like, comment, subscribe, share the video, like the video. If you guys want to support the channel, all the ways you can support are in the description below. I'll give you guys a quick second to do that. So. There, I was on Instagram recently, scrolling through, and I seen this weird, outrageous post. And the post is what's in the thumbnail. There is a father that made a jacket of his daughter in a compromising position. This was his way of celebrating his daughter's OnlyFans account being created. Think about how domesticated and docile you have to be to celebrate your own daughter making sexual content for the world to see parading it around. It's kind of sick in the mind to even think about the fact that he created something. He created a logo of his daughter in that kind of way. It's, it, it makes you think about the psyche of that. Is he secretly attracted to his daughter or some shit? Because why would you be so comfortable creating a compromising logo that shows your daughter doing something provocative and sexual. This is how messed up the training is in society today. This is how far men are gone. Men have dropped from the graces of what they used to be. We're like this watered down version of a man don't know who you are, what to think. You just see a woman and just automatically put her on a pedestal. You just see a woman and automatically praise her. She didn't even have to earn your attention. You just give the shit away for free. Simping means you're giving shit to a woman that isn't reciprocating the same actions of respect towards you. Why would men be so comfortable giving and giving and giving and giving to a woman that isn't giving them back? See, what has happened as you men have given up, you've given up, you've submitted, you stop fighting the program. That's what you've done. Now, your default setting is to simp. Now, your default setting is to just give money away. Three or fours are getting praised now more than ever. 
which is putting you good women in a compromising position. Because as you look out into the world, you're trying to be a good woman. You dress modestly. You're not on OnlyFans. You don't dress scantily clad in public. You don't have bikini pictures all down your Instagram pictures showing off your body. You're trying to do the right thing. You're trying to save yourself a marriage. You, you know, you're trying to do all the things that you look out into the world and all you see is 304s getting attention. Women are the ultimate social creatures, the ultimate followers. So of course, they're going to follow the attention. And so the good woman breaks from the social pressure and ends up being a 304 just from the seat so social pressures of society, just from feminism, just from all this other stuff, including simping because 304s are getting rewarded. They get relationships, they get marriages, they get children, they get validation, they get money, they get everything. So what incentive have we, have we created that will make women not do that? We don't have one. So why do we expect them to be anything else but 304s at this point? Because all we have is 304s, pretty much, mostly in the West, and all we have is simps. Now, you guys are trying to do the right thing. You guys, are, Some of you guys are masculine. You're trying to do the right thing. You're like, I am honoring and respecting these women, showing off their body, marrying these women. But you're getting canceled out too. You're, there's not enough guys that think like us in order for it to make a difference. Yeah, we might get, you know, women that want masculine and respectable men. Yeah, we'll get that. But it's not enough to change the whole dynamic of simping, the whole dynamic of 304ism right now. It's not. It's not. You guys want to know, and this is I'm going to end the video on this. You guys want to know when I knew it was done? When I knew we were at the point of no return? I knew we were at the point of no return when there was a pastor that was married to Megan Good. And this was a viral video. She went to church dressing scantily clad. One of the older women tried to check her on that saying, you're the first lady, you're supposed to dress modestly and respectfully. Your body isn't supposed to be advertised for every man in the church. You're supposed to have some respect for God, your man. That pastor got up and said, the first woman is going to do whatever she wants to do. And you guys know the funny shit? She ended up divorcing his ass. Simping ass pastor. So, put first things first, guys. Put your money first. Put winning first. Put those things first before you even think about dating these women. Because to be truthfully honest, chasing or dating a woman in this point in era is damn near a waste of time. Because the good women get plucked early. They get picked early. But that's my video. I want you guys to like, comment, subscribe, share your thoughts below in the comment section. I'm anxious to see what you guys have to say on your way out. If you guys want to support the channel, all the ways you can support in the description below. I appreciate you guys watching to the end. You guys have a good day, good week. And I'll see you guys in the next one, man. Peace.